What's going on YouTube? This is Mama5 and I'm back with you guys today with a new haul video. I have a Bath and Body Works haul of course and a Victoria's Secret fragrance haul. Both stores came out with new releases. I went to pick up things today and yesterday. I'm going to jump right into it because it's been hell trying to get this video uploaded you guys. I keep running out of space. I had to delete things out of my phone. The kids keep running in the room. It's just so much. Let me jump right into Victoria's Secret and the new items they released. Um, the new collection is called the Summer Vacay Collection. The first one from that collection is Coconut Sunshine on the Island. Of course, this is the coconut scent. Um, you guys, it's really not too much different from any other coconut scent. It does smell good. Um, and the packaging is very, very pretty. It's like an iridescent holographic um, type of packaging, which I really, really like. And the scent notes are guava and sandalwood. And it reads lazy afternoons, hot sun. And that's that one. Next up from the collection is Kiss Me in the Ocean. Which smells good. Once again, though, it, though it's not something that you haven't smelled before. Like It smells good, but it's nothing really, nothing really different. From any other like ocean type of scent, fresh and clean scent, but it does smell really good. And it reads dragon fruit and water lily. I don't really get the dragon fruit in it, but I do get the water lily. And it reads deep dives, sparkling waters. And by the way, you guys, these were on sale in my store for three for twenty-five. I picked up four, which brought the price down to like seven dollars and some change each, was which was not bad. We all know the um, retail price is eighteen dollars each, which I'll never pay that for a fragrance mist. I always get my fragrance mist and lotions on sale from Bath and Body Works and Victoria's Secret. I'll never pay full price. Next up. From the collection is Endless Days in the Summer, the purple packaging. Now it reads some sparkling peach and elder elderberry champagne, poolside sunset, and umbrella drinks. You guys, this is a repackage of Love Spell, like dead on. It is Love Spell in a different bottle. That's exactly what this is. If you already own Love Spell, do not go out trying to get this. The only reason why I picked this up, the packaging is pretty, but I don't have money to waste for packaging. The only reason why I picked this up is because I am a fan of the original Love Spell, and I don't own it in my collection. Okay. And last but not least, in the new Summer Vacay collection from Victoria's Secret, we have Escape With Me to the Beach. This is my absolute favorite in the collection. I do recommend you go out and pick this up. It smells so good. It's so fruity and juicy and just fresh and clean. The scent notes are freesia, vanilla, vanilla orchid, and it says tropical petals and warm sand. Um, the vanilla orchid is the, the stronger scent it's in this um, fragrance. The vanilla, I think, gives it like a soft, fruity type of smell. This is my favorite. It smells really good. Go pick that one up. And that is the new collection from Victoria's Secret. The Summer Vacay. Excuse me. <laughs> the Summer Vacay Collection. You have Escape With Me to the Beach. Endless Days in the Summer, which is Love Spill Repackaged. Kiss Me in the Ocean. And Coconut Sunshine on the Island really pretty packaging okay let's move on okay and yesterday my store had a table set out with some of the old collections they were trying to get rid of the body um, mist and the lotions and I picked up two of the lotions um, that they had on sale because I do have already have the fragrance mist in these scents and I figured why not they were on sale for $4.99 each and that is Love Spill Water Blooms and Temptation Water Blooms now this Love Spell Water, Bloom, Water Blooms is um, Love Spell with a twist. It does not smell like the original Love Spell. I mean, it had you, you, it got the scent, but it's a twist to it. And you can't beat it for 
$4.99. Okay. Next up is from Victoria's Secret Fine Fragrance Mist. Um, I just hauled, I believe it was my last video, they came out with Bombshell Seduction. And the set was on sale for, normally the, fra the Fine Fragrance Mists are $25 each in Victoria's Secret. But they had a sale going on by two for $25. So I picked up the lotion and the mist to Bombshell, bombshell Seduction. And this new scent is no different. This is Bombshell Summer. With the ombre packaging. It's really pretty and it smells really good. The original price is, like I just stated, $25. But they had a sale going on. So it was two for $25 with the fine fragrance mist and the lotions and the shower gel. So I picked up the Bombshell Summer Lotion to match. Not bad for $25. And it smells really good, you guys. I would recommend you get this also. Okay. And last but not least from Victoria's Secret, Pink also released a new fine fragrance, not fine fragrance, fragrance mist line uh, with three new fragrances. My store only had two of them. It was the pineapple one and the one that I picked up that I'm going to show you right now. They were on sale this particular day. I picked these up for $10 each, I believe, and the original price is $16.50 for pink fragrances. This is Solar Days. Um, and that is crushed hibiscus and ocean driftwood. This smells really, really good, you guys. You know, I love my clean laundry type of... This smells like when you got the laundry going and uh, the dryer and how the dryer sheets and the fabric softener has your house smelling and you just took a fresh shower and the soap, the soap is just lingering in the air. This is exactly what that smells like. I love this. So I do recommend you go pick this one up. Um, the last one, it, I think it's a coconut scent. That's the one that my store didn't have and they still don't have. I don't know what it smells like, but once I get a chance to, if I like it, I will haul that in my next video. And last but not least from Victoria's Secret, you guys. If you spent $40 in store yesterday and I think up until tomorrow, you get a spring rewards 20 off of 40 coupon, which is good for April 26. Sorry, April 17th through May 18th. I'm sorry, April 17th through May 6th. So, you know, I'm going to put that to good use. And that is all I picked up from Victoria's Secret. We're going to move on to Bath and Body Works. Okay. So yesterday I went to Bath and Body Works to pick up the lotions to the new collection that they just released a few weeks back. The, um... Kind of like the beach theme collection. I don't know the name of the collection exactly. And um, the sale yesterday was buy three body care items, get two free. Or buy two and get one free. So I chose to do the buy two and get one free. And I picked up Pink, pink Lily and Bamboo. I already um, described the scent notes in the last video from the fragrance mist. So I'm not going to go over them again. Next up I picked up. Waikiki Beach Coconut. Um, and then to complete this buy two get one free. I picked up Fresh Sea Salt and Mango. Which this is my favorite from the new collection. Now I know I've been saying in my videos. That I'm going to slow down on purchasing the lotions and the, the creams. But you guys I need to layer my scents. They last longer to me and it's more potent to me if you layer them so I'm just going to try to use my products up a little bit quicker just so that my lotions and creams don't go bad okay and yesterday they had a, a thing going on sorry about that um yesterday they had a promotion going on in store if you spent over ten dollars you get a free body care item um priced up to fourteen dollars or less so I went on ahead and grabbed the island white sand so that makes this collection complete now I now own the fragrance mist and the lotion in this collection 
and I did yesterday. The candles were on sale, and today they were on sale for twelve ninety five. I picked up two of those. I picked up the um, eucalyptus mint and the cactus blossom, which I hauled in one of my previous videos. Those are two of my favorites right now. So I just re um, repurchased those. I have them burning right now, so I, that's why I can't show you. But that's what I got yesterday from Victoria, not Victoria's Secret, Bath and Body Works. So then today I was at work and I got the email, which will check in my email. I saw that they released their new scents today at Bath and Body Works and everything, all the fragrance mist was on sale for $5. So of course, once I got off, I ran right up there and took advantage of that deal. And here's my bag. Okay. Okay, and the first thing I picked up was Happy Vibes. Now, you know I'm going to give my honest opinion about all of the things that I haul on my channel. And my honest opinion of this is what the heck is going on with this packaging. This is supposed to be Happy Vibes. It says "Smart start every day with a Happy Vibes. Enjoy the, this energizing blend of pink citrus, crisp pear, and fresh honeysuckle. I mean, where's the happy vibe from this packaging, you guys? I'm really not feeling this packaging at all. At all. And on top of that, this is um, a repackage, in my opinion, to white citrus. It smells just like white citrus. I don't smell the pear. I don't smell the honeysuckle. All I smell is citrus. It smells good but it smells just like white citrus so if you own white citrus i don't recommend you pick this up um now i do own white citrus in the fine fragrance mist but i didn't realize how much it smelled like white citrus until after i left the store but yeah this is definitely um white citrus repackaged and once again all of the fine fragrance mist was five dollars today Next up from the new collection is Wild Rose and Apple. This is my favorite from the collection because this is the only one that smells sort of different. Um, you do smell the rose in it. It's not an overpowering rose scent. Um, and the scent notes are distilled natural rose oil, pink peony, apple blossom, and soft musk. Um, it's a bit musky. But it still smells good. And the packaging is adorable. I really do love the packaging. Next up is... Excuse me. Pink Magnolia. The pretty butterflies on the packaging. You guys can see that. Now, me and Bath and Body Works... We gonna have to fight because once again, this is a repackage. This is pink cashmere. It smells just like pink cashmere to me. If you own pink cashmere, I do not suggest you pick this up. It smells good, but it's pink cashmere all over again. And pink cashmere um, and white citrus wasn't in the store today. So I guess they pulled those from the shelves because they knew that they were going to bring out happy vibes and pink magnolia. You guys... Uh, I just feel like, you know, we spent, a lot of us spend a lot of money in Bath and Body Works. We deserve product, new scents. Like, it's so many things that you can mix up and make new scents and all that stuff. Stop giving us repackaged product. If that's the case, bring out some of our oldies but goodies that you guys only sell online and let us buy those things. Stop bringing us repackaged things and we get all excited and it's the same old stuff. But it does smell good. Nevertheless, I'm not going to lie. It's just a repackage. Okay, and last but not least from the new collection is chamomile and honey. It smells good. It smells like kind of like a aromatherapy um scent. Um it smells similar to something I've smelled before. I'm not gonna say it's repackaged, but it does smell good. Again, the packaging is really pretty. And the scent notes are steam distilled natural chamomile oil, fresh bergamot, sweet honeysuckle, and white cedar wood. 
and I didn't read the um, scent notes to Pink Magnolia. That is Steam Distilled Natural Magnolia Oil, Jasmine Petals, Wild Orchid, and Sheer Musk. And this is all of the new releases from Vic Bath and Body Works. Excuse me. You got Happy Vibes. Then from the new collection, you have Wild Rose and Apple, Pink Magnolia, Chamomile, and Honey. I, I just want to say for the summer collection, you guys, that I think they're going to bring out, I hope it's some new stuff with some pretty, pretty packaging because I'm just getting a little bored with Bath and Body Works. Honestly. Like, come on with it, you guys. We are so ready for it. Okay, and these are... The next ones are things, fragrance mist that I have the lotions to or the creams to. I just didn't have the body mist. And I went on ahead and grabbed them because they were just $5. And that is Beautiful Day. And, excuse me, French Lavender and Honey. And then today they also had the sale with, um, if you spent more than, um, was it, yeah, if you spent more than $10 in store, um, you got to pick out a, um, excuse me, you get to pick out a body care item, uh, with the price up to $14, and I went on ahead and picked up the In the Sun body lotion. To match the fragrance mist that I picked up a few weeks ago. So I can layer my scents. It's kind of like a glare. Okay, you guys. I believe that is it. That is all I have for you guys this video. Thanks for tuning in. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I have, I believe, 70 viewers not now. And I'm very, very grateful for that. I wasn't expecting it. Um, as long as you guys keep viewing, I will keep uploading these videos and giving you guys my honest reviews on them. Until next time, you guys. See you later.